Hi guys, today we're talking about Louis Vuitton bag charms. Um, I'm in love with the bag charms. Uh, I just have a problem with the price. Uh, golden, metal, and resin. Not even gold. And plastic. What you're paying for is the Louis Vuitton name. They are gorgeous, but they are pricey. Are they truly worth it? And truly, nobody needs a bag charm. What can I say? I have a problem. Um, today we're talking about the Insolence Bag Charm and the Fleur de Toile, forgive my French. Um, the first one is the Insolence Charm. It's item 65844 on the Louis Vuitton site. Um, it's about 5 and 7 eighths inch tall and uh, the widest one here is uh, 1 and 15 sixteenths inches wide. Um, beautiful. Uh, the other one <clears throat> that I had a problem with, and obviously couldn't contain myself, is the Fleur de Toile, which is um, item M66456 on the Louis Vuitton site. Described as golden metal resin Swarovski crystals. But I mean, who can blame me? They are gorgeous. Um, the Insolence Charm normally lives on my uh, Sully bag. Gorgeous. But equally gorgeous on the Neverfull. The thing about I liked about the Insolence Charm is it, it um, Complements all the monogram and the damier canvas because of the brown color. And then finally on the Speedy. Um, this, um, this charm, the Fleur de Toile, normally I keep it on my Speedy, Speedy 30. But again, beauty of the charm, it looks good on everything. So as I say, Nobody needs a bag charm. I realize that. Um, I have a problem. Hello, my name is BJ and I have a Louis Vuitton addiction. I plan to join a 12-step program, uh, but I need to get a couple of things off my wish list first because I don't want to be too rash and cut myself off prematurely. Uh, so let me know what you think about bag charms. Um, I know they are way overpriced in terms of what they are. Uh, you are paying for the Louis Vuitton name purely and simply. Um, I did look at the replica sites and came very close multiple times to purchasing a replica Louis Vuitton bag charm. Uh, but when it came down to submitting my credit card information, I just couldn't press that button. Um, because essentially you are trusting someone who's already proven that they have no problems stealing. If they have no problems stealing from Louis Vuitton, I'm sure they have no problems stealing from me, so um, I just couldn't do it. <laughs> so I figured, like a bag, if you're going to invest, invest in the authentic. Um, I do look for them on the secondary market. Um, of course, it works out that most of the ones I want are not available because they are probably just as popular to other people. So, leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. Have a great day.